Oh, hello, Wild Ones. I'm here in the mountains today, exploring this little corner of paradise. I've got my Lanshan Pro One today. I thought with spring finally here, it'd be a good idea to get to grips with my super light hiking tents again. So let's do it. Come join me for a night in the wild. It is really, really warm today. 18 degrees in the shade. I'm not complaining. It's absolutely beautiful. But oh, I'm roasting. So I'm gonna spend as much time as possible in the water today. There is a river over there. I'm gonna head up, find somewhere to get in it, have a dip. I am melting. Let's cool off a bit. this will be perfect look put the tent down there and just over here right next to a stream so I can get my water from there amazing okay let's have a play with this tent it's been a while hey fella here's me tent really light I think it's like 690 grams and it goes up with a trekking pole I've not used it in about a year I think so I need to get reacquainted with it. So if I remember rightly, take the back in and then put the trekking pole in the front, I think. What I've done here is I've stuck some non-slip stuff on top of my trekking pole to hopefully work better with the tension tents. I can't figure out why I've got a flappy front bit. I don't understand why I'm well out of practice for these kind of tents. Oh, oh yeah, that's better. Okay. Look at this monster crawling along on my tent. I have to have a good tick check later. Ugh. So this mat is a little bug-free, tick-free haven to sit on. It's too hot to sit in a tent. Oh, I'm sweltering again. There's a lot of biders out. Really, I should put some clothes on, but I'm too freaking hot. 22 degrees and it's, and it's half seven. I think it's okay. It's not perfect. But it will do, I think, for tonight. And look at these views. I'm gonna make my dinner now. So I've got piri piri rice, muffed up roll, butter, and I might chop up the pepper army to stick in me rice as well. Temperature's dropping a bit now, it's about 16 degrees. Oh, it's much more comfortable. And I'm really, really loving having this little ground sheet. And it's been amazing today, just to put down on the ground when I've been in the water so I can dry off on it. So I can sit outside the tent without bugs crawling all over me and ticks getting all over me. I'm really interested to see if maybe I can get a super lightweight little ground sheet to sit on. So I'm gonna look for one of those. So I think that'd be really handy. Let's do hench. Let's see what my bridey's got. Oh, it's just gone chilly. It really drops once that sun goes. I don't think it's gonna rain tonight so I might try leaving this door open this is a single skin tent so of course I'll take this off now it's crazy with the condensation but if I leave the door open it might be okay I'll shut the mesh of course I'm loving being out in it so far it has such summer vibes there's so many little twinkly lights in the mountains opposite been watching them for about an hour it's so lovely from a distance it's so nice to watch these tiny people doing their thing and wondering who they are and what kind of adventures they're having it makes me feel all warm and cozy inside 
Alright you guys, I'm going to go to bed so I'll see you in the morning and we'll decide what to do with the day. Night! Good morning. It is a beautiful, still, clear, cloudy morning. It's really mild, like 15 degrees. The mountains have got their heads in the clouds this morning. I've had a nice seven hours sleep, so I feel lovely and refreshed and relaxed. I think today I'm going to head over there and we'll look for somewhere to have lunch in the little forest down there before we get going. Cuckoo! Thank you, camping place. So that was a really nice first night out of the year with the Lanshan to get reacquainted with it. I really loved it, but it was really nice, easy weather. So I need to have it out in some bad weather and have a good night with it in bad weather. Let's see what we're doing with it. <laughs> nice puddle down there but I suppose if you're using a good reliable bivvy bag over your sleeping bag tents leaking and failing and whatnot it's more of an annoyance than like a life-threatening issue but after a long day of hiking in the mountains it's an annoyance I'd rather do without right we're heading over there into that forest and we're gonna have to cross the river if we can get up there. Oh, we're up. Oh, look how pretty. Oh, it's so nice. I think I'm just gonna head over there. Stop for some lunch. <laughs> so my tummy just rumbled then. I'm gonna chill out here a little while longer and then I'm gonna head back down and that'll be the end of another amazing 24 hours in the wild. I have just loved it. Thank you so much for sharing it with me, you guys, and I'll see you again soon. Bye. Look at them go. Wee!